Tuesday, but just briefly, we are having a peer leader meeting on Monday at three, um, just to finalize. So everybody is very comfortable with the concept and fully understands it and talk about what commonalities they might want to have um, in the different thematic areas. Um, they are then going to be reaching out to their groups. Um, we're still looking for people to be involved. Um, we have a lot of young people on this call, so that's really good. If anybody is interested that's not already signed up to be in one of the thematic areas that would like to participate, I'd be thrilled. Just send me an email. Um, and, but I mean, every group has sort of three or four at least. The largest group is six. I don't think it should get much larger than eight or 10 because then it's gonna be hard to actually achieve anything. So the, uh, hopefully next week, they're gonna have their first smaller group meeting and actually begin the, the curriculum development. So that's where we stand. Okay, and uh, Hori, can we, uh, yeah, go ahead. I was just gonna say, um, I was a little bit distracted. Again, the brain issue. Um, did you say each group already has at least three or four? Oh yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll send awesome. you the list so you can see it. That would be it's cool, actually, if you can share out that. Nicely. Yep. Mm -hmm. And the leaders are also recruiting a few people that they know of. So everybody's kind of pitched in and it's working. Mm -hmm. Yeah, great. Yep. I will. I'll send you that. And you should know that um, at Krishanti's uh, advice, I've been in touch with two educators who are human rights educators um, who are really prolific uh, in their field. And they have agreed to act as kind of advisors at some point to make sure that the human rights part is well integrated into the work that's going on. And they also have modules which they've developed already and we've shared those with the groups so that the groups will have some idea of, of different, you know, different ways of doing a module development and all that. So I think it's really so well and right. Erica, you're coordinating very well and, and managed to crystallize from from these meetings or sort of the essence of what people need to take away from that. So Thanks. for that. Uh, and Hori, if we could at some point open it up again to volunteers coming in, I think. Well, actually that's, that's why I'm, I'm kind of glad that we're having this conversation and Devin is on this call because I really want to highlight this in some way in tomorrow's newsletter the generation equality newsletter that we send out on the last Friday of each month. I'm not sure if you all are aware that CSAC has slowed down to almost a halt, which is not real, like at least publicly, right? So privately we're, we're doing a lot of work, the action coalitions and, you know, there's so much negotiations with France, Mexico, all of that, but publicly there's not much we can share. And I really want to keep the momentum going. And I, I'm trying very hard, and this is what we've been all busy with all day, actually, trying to figure out what to put out there for people to stay engaged and excited and, you know, see all the connections and that we are br breaking silos left and right. So I'm not sure what um, Devin has as far as information, but may, perhaps between Devin, Sun Yang, and Erica, we can come up with a really good story. Sure. <laughs> and then if you want to have any call for... Yeah, uh, Erica, if you can just drop a little paragraph on sure. <clears throat> what it is and where we're going with it, and then do a call for people to participate more, that's one. Devin, the other thing is I noticed that on the thematic group's big list, there are people still signing up. I mean, as of last week, there were still people signing up. So um, we, we, if we could encourage people to sign up into that main database, that way we can keep updating our um, main database as well. So if you could put that out as a link, I think that would also be useful for us because from that database, you know, we can, we need some main database, not just those who are into the thematic groups and so on. So that was. So I have a, a, a master email list, which is everybody that I've heard from that wanted to be involved in right. the universities and yeah. teachings. But then the I have the, the that, yeah, thematic well, group yeah. participants. Mm -hmm. So at some point, what we need to do, Galene, is we need to merge her, now her list with the conference lists that we've done, because we have lists from the five, uh, six conferences with uh, the thematic groups um, 
the master list, which yeah, continues you want me to send it to, to evolve. Yeah. So yeah, okay. uh, yeah, it's it's continuing to evolve, and I know that some of the university people are probably not on that main database yet. So so um, if we have, is there anything else? Um, I have a question about the um, human rights educators that you were talking about that would be great experts for us. Do you think we might be able to invite one of them to speak at next the next meeting we're having, which is the 11th of May? You know, they've they've asked not to be involved in that fashion. They've asked okay because they're okay. both in the midst of writing books, um, uh -huh. and and they have stay at home responsibilities as well at this sure. point. They've okay. asked not to do that. But okay. um, what I want to do is share their bios with you at some point, and share also any of the materials that are coming in from them. If I could. that's the other thing I have a collection of is short bios. They're fantastic. Yeah, I yeah, yeah, yeah. It, The groups really, now, so really we're hitting it a good. Yeah. Era of of knowledge yeah. and expertise. Yeah. Great. yeah. Okay. Okay. So in the time remaining, I wanted to show um, Jordan and Reina and maybe anyone else who's not actually seen this what our um, what our voice voice platform looks like and what I managed to do is to get our people to give me um, a summary list of the registration pages at this point these link to the different thematic areas and also the conversation pages uh, we're just missing the environment one and and um, we're finalizing that very soon. What I want to show you here is that we're experimenting with the idea that some of the videos would be in different languages. For example, we've asked Nurgle to do one section, which is just her video in Russian, and Mabel to do one in Spanish. Um, so, so this is the kind of thing that we can put together now that some of the voice voice platforms are being finalized. So. Um, yeah, let's see if this new share will work. Um, this is what this is what the um, the first page looks like when you actually enter, and then it um, it has an Welcome intro to video. Welcome the feminist and women's movement action plan for Beijing twenty five. Let's talk freedom from violence, stigma, and stereotypes. Freedom from Violence, Stigma, and Stereotypes is one of six thematic working groups that are part of the large Global Beijing 25 Advisory Committee Working Group. This conversation covers the Beijing Platform for Action, Critical Areas of Concern, Violence Against Women, Human Rights of Women, The Girl Child, and Women in Health, plus CDAW and SDG targets. Hi there, my name is Sun Yang Yoon with the International Alliance of Women. I'm one of the drivers of the Feminist and Women's Movement Action Plan, along with Melissa Upreti and Prishanti Damaraj of the Center for Women's Global Leadership. Today you're going to start a dialogue which is your contribution to what we need to put together for the Feminist and Women's Movement Action Plan and maybe coalitions. This dialogue will grow and become a global dialogue. It should give us courage to know that we are with many, many others who care about gender equality and women's empowerment. I hope you've started the discovery of the United Nations documents, the Beijing Platform for Action, the, set, the Convention on the Elimination of All Forms of Discrimination Against Women, or CEDAW, and some of the Sustainable Development Goal documents. They are our foundation, and in them we find hope because governments have committed to these documents and we can lean on them and make claims on them in our demands for the future. So it will be an exciting journey with many, many other people, and uh, we look forward to hearing your ideas, your commitments to action, and we're listening. So that opens it, and then you join here. And Wait, are, we, are we supposed to see um, the screen change? Because right now it's still the page. Oh, sorry about that. Um, 
I'm going to have to stop the share and go back to it again. Hold on just a minute. Welcome to the Feminist and Women's Movement Action Plan. So are you hearing Beijing anything? Plus I'm definitely we hearing hear it. it. Just didn't you have see been it. invited yeah. to these virtual... Oh, now it's the... Yes, I see it. Yeah, it's better now. now. Okay. All right. So uh, I, just, I, I just want you to know that it goes in this fashion. And uh, where you see my picture here, we would actually have everyone who's joined the conversation there. Welcome to the Feminist and, and then Women's Movement I'm going to skip plan. this one again. The Beijing Platform for I'm going to skip this one. Women and Violence. And what I what uh, I wanted to show you here is that the we have two videos. One is the animation video that FUS has made, and then it goes to um, the video made by the expert. This one is made by Fatima in Arabic. So we're stigma, experimenting with the idea that that when this other people invite in some people Arabic. into this conversation, if Fatima they know that this Kafaji, one is in Arabic, they may feel free to actually speak. Arab women speaks about how gender-based violence has serious consequences such as loss of self-esteem, self-worth, physical and poor mental health. Gender-based violence impacts national productivity and burdens healthcare systems. See her briefing paper in English on the registration page. So whenever After we have something video, in foreign language, we, we have the with briefing a paper question. in English. So people can follow I that. I love it. I, I just think we need to invite. على أساس المساواة مع الرجل ويمثل أيضا أز أز ومعاناة سواء جسدية أو عقلية أو جنسية. So I'm actually going to skip this video. We're not seeing the video. You're not seeing the video. Uh -uh. Now we're on the page she brought us into, but then it just stayed there. Yeah, I think the screen is just not moving automatically. Maybe it needs. All right. Okay. It just goes. Well, all right. I'm going to stop this share because it's frustrating for you guys. What I what I wanted to simply um, show you is that we're almost done. <laughs> with yeah, me. great. And That's it good. takes about an hour to go through the the process, and at the very end. You can choose actions, share it on Facebook. You can invite five more people in your conversation and that sort of thing. Um, I'll figure out the screen share better sometime. But what I would like to invite you to do is to help test these at some, at very soon. So I'm going to send you a um, link next time. We're going to meet in one of those spaces instead of on Zoom. And we'll actually go through each of them. Um, that one was on violence, but so is there a preference on which one we go through? It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Violence sounds good enough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've already gotten a peek at violence. Um, well, okay, so there's the one else? on peace and security is pretty good, um, and. Um, Maybe I do would like that. Seeing, seeing Mabel on the one on participation might be fun to see how the Spanish one works since Jordan can understand all of it. We won't be able to do that. So my, that's my suggestion. We actually meet next time into that platform. Okay. Mm -hmm. So um, we can actually see how it works and we will have then collectively tested one of them. But one of the things that I invite um, our volunteers to do is to do it separately. And we're going to go through all of them. And we also need to test all the registration pages, which if I can try to share again. The screen mm -hmm. looks like this. Um, oops, where are we? This. Can you see that? Um, Feminist Women's Action yes. Plan. Yeah? Yes. Can you see this? So on the registration page. Oh, right down on the bottom. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. Keep scrolling. Yeah. Oh. See that? Can you see that, Erica? Yeah, I can. It's it's the page. Yeah. So it's With this actually, the same. Yeah. right. So yeah. this is where we need to test all those links because those links take us to the documents, mm -hmm. and that's 
that's actually the opening for, for the conversation. So what we're asking is people to read these documents before they come into the conversation. Okay. If I click on that, do you see uh, any document pop up? It's coming so slowly, uh, Dropbox. Slowly? Yeah, okay. So it'll go to the Beijing Platform mm -hmm. Profession Text on Women in Health. And um, that, do you see that there? And then, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You see it? Okay, yeah. so those are, that's the kind of testing that we need to do is to make sure that those links are to the right pages uh, and all of that. Um, so are there any questions on that? No, but I'm happy to test. So if you want to send it to me, I, I think okay. it'd be interesting right. just to see what's in there and see. What I'm going to send, I'm going to send the invitation right. for testing to everyone for the ones as we roll them along. We'll meet on one particular one next time. And anyone who wants to join, I'll just set it uh, a time for us to meet and, um, and we'll, you know, those of us, uh, those of us who can meet there at that time, we'll go through them. We have six of them to go through. Um, so, uh, Great. I have to run, but thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, 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 I will do it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Uh, okay. And, um, Galene, if you could stay, Devin, if you're interested, if you could stay, Jordan and Raina. Okay. And we're supposed uh, and to Uzma, um, everyone else can leave because we're going to be talking about the assignments for the volunteers to do, but or you can stay as well. <laughs> it's just like, no, no, it's okay. No, I, um, yeah, I, yeah, I, there I are other things to do, I'm sure. Um, but, but um, should, like, should we decide when should be our regular meeting? Like, we do it at two o'clock instead of 4 30. Okay, so on Thursdays, Thursday. two o'clock, and yeah, and the testing time, if you don't mind, I would like to set it just for the hour before. So well, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Next week we have the YP meeting, which is one to three p.m. Right, Devin? On Thursday. Yeah. On Thursday. Okay. So for next week. Um, and that's really important. I would love everybody Thursday to. Thursday a there. bad day is Wednesday. In well. Um. I mean, once a month, it's, yeah. I mean, Wednesday actually is easier because a lot of our meetings are Tuesdays and Thursdays. Yes, I don't know, what do you think? Yeah. I think Tuesdays and Thursdays are difficult with yeah. meetings. Okay, now. all right, all right, yeah. Let's switch it to Wednesday, all right? So Wednesday, let's meet at, um, let's meet at one o'clock for testing. Okay. And two o'clock for our regular meetings. Does that work for everyone? Perfect. Yeah. I just need to double check that with Melissa and Krishanti. Mm -hmm. Sure. Maybe that works. Okay. Yeah. So we'll change that to that. And I will send you invitations for the one o'clock for next Wednesday and the Wednesday after that and things like yeah. that. Okay. Excellent. All right. Great. Thank Thanks you. Thanks a lot, everyone. Thank you all. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I go, no, 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 Billy. And Jordan and Raina, stay with me, Uzma. Yeah, just me <laughs> and Ivy. <laughs> okay. Good, Ivy. Bye-bye. Right. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye, Ivy. Um, mm -hmm. So, Uzma, we can't see you. I suspect you're on your phone. But, um, yes. Or <laughs> uh, what I wanted to mention is that what, um, Galene, do you want to review for us what you and, and Devin talked about you know doing the assignments you were going to do yes I was just gonna send that to you today uh, about the links you mean yeah so tell everyone else what what those sheets are okay so um, basically we were uh, I, I mean we we're gonna do a master list just for the links uh, and there, there was there's gonna be like separate uh, sheets for the animations and separate sheets for the for the people and then uh, we're just gonna sort that out by the author. You're gonna, have to, you're gonna have to do more detail because Jordan and Raina don't know what the animation is or what the people are. Okay yeah yeah uh, I'm not sure how to um, explain. So there are uh, videos uh, for feminist and women's movement action plan and we're gonna we're gonna collect those videos and we're gonna create 
basically a master list of those videos. Did I explain that correctly or? Okay, yeah. And I'm just gonna send that um, to you shortly. And the other one is? Uh, there's another uh, one. Yeah, so there are two kinds of videos. There are the animation videos, and the other ones are videos of the experts, and they're gonna be in separate places. Yeah, separate, right? yeah, separate. yeah. Okay, so um, on, the <clears throat> on the animation ones, it doesn't really matter what order they're in. They basically cover the 12 critical areas of concern, the Beijing platform. For the, for the expert um, videos, um, I, I, if we could review a little bit, what we need is that in, in alphabetical order of the last name of the expert. And we need also the text. In, in all cases, we need the text that's in the YouTube explanation. Even of the animation videos, we need, we need the exact title of that. And then we need the text that's in the YouTube explanation of what that is, also in the master list. In other words, it's not just a link to the videos. Yes, yes, I, yeah, you mentioned that. Okay. okay, and also for the expert videos, same thing, title, name, what, what's in the video, and then the link. And yeah. that way we'll be able to give those pages to the university teaching groups so that they, they will also have them um, available to them. And then also I can cut and paste some of those so that, and separate them into the six thematic areas, okay? So that's one. And then the, the other um, uh, thing which, Uzma, I wonder if you could do this. If you could go to the, to the page where we have the 3,000 or 2,000 people who signed up they're still signing up, but we haven't updated that into a master list. Mm -hmm. If you could update that master list. All right. Yeah? But for that, I need the link of the, that page only. What is that? The link of the page I need to update. Uh, right. Okay, so let me resend you that link, mm -hmm. okay? Um, that's the link where everyone is signing up. And um, Devin, if we could add Jordan and Reina, um, how can we do that? Can we add them to the to the university and teach in and the global working group? Yeah. This. Or if you, the, if you guys want to just put in your emails in the chat too, I can plug you guys in too. Yeah. Okay. So why don't you just send your emails in the chat? Yes, um, is it a, so that you get invited so that you get invited into all yeah. the is yeah. it on Google or is it on what is like what Google the chat, the chat is down there in zoom if you go okay. down yeah no I was just wondering if it was like the the group was through Google or if yeah. it was a different platform but Google yeah for, okay. okay great okay so Uzma is going to do the update that I'll send you the link for that Mm -hmm. um, Galene and Devin are going to work on the videos and the master list. Um, the briefing papers, we also have briefing papers and um, I think what we want to do with that is once we have the video list, I'll send you the briefing. Devin, don't you have all the briefing papers? Yes. Okay, yeah. So we also need a third thing of the briefing papers. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. And also alphabetically by the by the authors, so that we have links to those briefing papers. And then, uh, Galene, I'm going to ask if you would help Reina and Jordan understand that framework page that we created at the very beginning, which has Beijing Platform for Action, CDAO, and the SDGs. I'll resend that to you so you remember what that is. But yeah. I, it's, explaining to them that all those long texts are available in Spanish and French. So if we can create a Spanish version and a French version of that page, which has links to the documents, mm -hmm. okay, then that would be a great project um, to get going. And that would, that would really help us as we try to expand our um, accessibility. Um, and for that language one, let's set a few deadlines. Usma, if you could have your update by the next time we meet. Yes. Um, Devin and uh, Galene, if, if you could get your pages 
done um, before then, because the university groups are really anxious to get into the materials. Yeah. What would be a reasonable time for you guys to get that in? Um, well, I was thinking also it would be good to have them for the newsletter tomorrow, too. Okay. So um, is that possible for you, Galeen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, okay. uh, I, I'll, I can send it to you tonight. Like, okay, bye. yeah. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Because okay. that's about so you, Did you send it to me first to make sure that I... Yeah. yeah. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Okay. So then that's out. And really, the university teaching folks, they, they're hungry for this kind of, 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 um, yeah. Yeah. of introduction. And then for the Spanish and French versions of the framework page, we can have a little bit longer time frame for that. It'll take some research and some tweaking because, Galeen, you may remember that the Beijing Platform for Action that's online in those languages is not sliced up. Into yeah, the I know. Section. So yeah. you'll have to explain to them. If you guys, three of you could meet at some point. Yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe I'll get offline and then you guys can meet. <laughs> I know we'll, we'll arrange something, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, figure that one out. That would be great. And that could take, you know, two weeks if you guys can work. Time. Are you in finals yet? No, Me. no, because you're both free. You're both I free. don't have finals. Not so have finals. <laughs> this is your final. All right. <laughs> My finals are the, the first uh the first full week of may okay Almost. all right okay all right so anyways it's it's what i'm saying it's not an urgent urgent project so so but but it it is um something that's really going to be valuable for us so that's great um and i think both of you can also translate if we need something translated um you're both proficient enough so guys well welcome to the multi-language <laughs> team which is going to be better than what the UN can produce okay so I uh, really appreciate it I'm going to sign off if you guys want to stay on you can Galeen and Raina and Jordan um and can you please resend me the form that you I'm going to send you that uh the framework page maybe after you see that you can, you can see each other uh do you have the contacts for Jordan and Raina yet yes yeah it's in the collective email as well that, that I sent you Galeen so you'll see their emails in there. You see it? Okay. Yep. Uh, just... Okay. Yep. Okay. So guess what I'm doing tonight? Uh, you couldn't possibly guess. So <laughs> I'm going to dress up. You'll see it. I'll send you the picture. I can dress up, put on my jewelry, and go to a gala for Biden. Oh, wow. <laughs> He's doing a virtual gala and i don't know if there's going to be dancing or what's going to happen but anyways that's my evening <laughs> that'll be interesting <laughs> we'll see how it works <laughs> thanks a lot wow, yeah, great take care of everyone else yeah thanks a lot guys <laughs>